let's check out the energy. You might want to get a smoke court. Shout out to my friend, Divine Space. Make sure you follow her. She got me this cool ass mic. Testing one, two. Y'all, y'all know I can't act right. Ooh, the Empress. I know that's right with the Ace of Swords. All right, let me, let me try to be, because you know, I got the mic. I feel so professional. But reporting live, broadcasting on Channel 10, we bring to you the bad news. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. It's actually good news. Well, it smells like success, too. These are my favorite, like, like the anointing oil. I, I put so much love on it. The three of wands. Ooh, you got an adventure. A success. Someone could go fishing with somebody. Now, the ten of swords, I feel like after a bad betrayal and you hitting rock bottom due to some type of Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, um, you planning for the future. You're traveling. And this person refused to learn. Okay, you got a new contract, you got a new breakthrough, okay? They could have lost a job or they being overworked at their job and underpaid. Um, yeah, they left you for a dark witch. You're a good witch, okay? And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I feel so fancy. Get in here. Let's dance. Yeah, I love that. Some of y'all need to get a black turmoil um, crystal. It's like some competition, but they can't. I feel like they were just bringing competition and chaos, if you ask me. You know, it's sad. The energy I'm getting, this person had to get another chick, a third party, to come against you. So this is that could tell you where this person's mindset is, that you are messy, that you are one of those guys that have to, like, you're not going to let an ex walk away so easily without trying to mentally disturb they, they peace or like you know let's say the third party want to come into you as a woman like you don't even care no more because you don't even know the other side and that's confirmation you know this person's the devil they worship the devil this that's their loss like you probably gave this person chance after chance after chance until you learn like hey this person really don't like you like this or love you like they say they do you feel me you got, you moving forward. You caught this person with the seven of swords or they confess that well, that little business was not going to do good or you're not going to be successful. But you always encourage this person, this devil, giving them love. You probably fall for they, you know, the okie doke, the little soft story everybody have, you know. This person don't believe in God. With the higher friend, it's like they are rebellious. Like this is a person that go to church but do un- there could be a warlock, a dark warlock. This is a person that needs to energy harvest on women energy. That's why they always sleeping around. They overspend too. This is a person that will don't yeah, corrupt with the King of Pentacles in reverse. Very greedy. Yeah. This person's sacred chakra is blocked. And they're a page of cups. Alright, give me more on the imprints and what's coming in for the new contract. Mm. With the tower and the death, like you have went through something, maybe even a loss of a loved one, and um, learned that I'm not dealing with someone. I surrender. I had listened to uh, Never Would Have Made It Without You this morning. Hangman. Yeah. I feel like you have a positive, you're healing, you're moving on with the five of cups in reverse. Yeah, you, you literally walking away. Shit, with the queen of pentacles upright. You're very reliable, very wise. You very stay focused on your work. Something about like you're staying focused. I gotta stay focused. It's like you even reviewing your content or trying to get better at editing, working out, staying consistent. I see that you're staying consistent with working out. But someone wants to be consistent when it comes to their self-employment, like making more inventory, making more things. You know, you could know that you have like some type of insecurity or discouragement or repressed feelings. I feel like, you know, write it in a journal burn it, let it go. You're very assertive, okay? I feel like you could be a little impatient too, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. But somebody's coming in to give you a gift. Be vigilant how you talk. But the Nine of Pentacles is like you're going to see the fruit of your labor. You're going to get that new car, that new apartment. You know, the Nine of Pentacles is also telling me that you're single. So you're enjoying the fruit of your labor. 
you know, um, someone could like birds too, or want to get a pet rabbit. Something about butterflies and ladybugs inside the house. That's really significant. But the fruit of the labor is like your hard work is about to pay off. It's like if you miss a couple days of posting, people are going to be going to your YouTube, you know. Also, follow me on YouTube. Yeah, whoever this person that um, tried to delay you, you don't trust them, they're trying to come back. I don't know. And try to delay actions because you have an ace of cups, the emperor. Like this person knew that you was a wife and knew that you could have someone that provides to you, cater to you. They could even make fun of you. Like, oh, they sister have a boyfriend that caters to them or they niece. Like, I'm going to make sure, you, you know, you never get played. And, and it's like kind of throwing shade. It's like when my friend said narcissistic where – a man knows that a woman's po um, a man's a man's supposed to provide, and then they're saying something in front of the niece is like, you know, I'm gonna make sure you never get played because basically, men can't be trusted. It's even mad when a man like you know the ego get bruised because it's like you're just trying to jog or mind your business, and this person want to be annoying, and just watch you like. Yeah, I, I kid you not. The lovers in reverse, the nine of cups. This person gonna be very forceful. You know, the two of pentacles is like, yeah, this person talk really bad about you. Like someone's mad that you're not at the two of pentacles, you're at the seven of pentacles, you're seeing the fruit of your labor, the hard work, it's paying off. Somebody hate that you're not a pushover. You know, somebody wants you to be a pushover or like scared to fight, but it's like, why would you fight when you are you're a millionaire or six figures? Like you're only like that's for like that's high school shit, like someone stuck in the past and not letting go i feel like do one more core cutting it's like they can't feel your energy and they mentally trap with the eight of swords like you could understand this person was bipolar you feel me um because maybe you are too or you have your own things but it's like they was toxic this is the type of person that will bring conflict um betrayal and they will betray you it's like you was the target like, it's not like, you know, like, going to Target, you're having a good shopping. Like, no, you was the target. Like, not only they was using you for help, but they would target you to hurt you. This Their person's heart chakra is blocked, and they're trying to make a decision with the two of swords, and they're stubborn. Is that so stubborn? And they're stuck in the middle. I feel like you made it easier for them. Okay, you want to pick between me and her? Sh shit, have her. And this person, it bruised their ego because this is the type of person that's very low self-esteem, and they're facing judgment, where it's like, they are used to having people that, you know, they can easily manipulate. And um, it's like bully. Like, you could have called this person a bully. Well, I say stuck in the middle because it's like, you let them have them. Because it's like, I don't know if this person, like, this is a tactic. For, if you have stayed in it, this person wants to make it, make you seem like you to pick me or insecure. And you're Maddie. You feel me? You might have let shit slide, but now you know not to ever let one shit slide. Like, you know at all because this king of cups is the reason why he don't got that family that he wants so bad he's the one who shattered it uh, heavy on aries someone really needs to focus on the uh, insecurities and they freaking wealth they literally have a facade you might think that they got it together no they're going to be dishonest and it's the end to that cycle you have someone who's attentive coming with the chariot and people might be mad and resentful and be like damn she was supposed to be with a dusty man, a dusty woman. We almost got him. Like, no. So you go through hell. It's almost like the TikTok where I showed this, my my moderator. It was like, uh, you know, date for money. You've been dating for love, and all you've been doing is, like, but I don't feel like you should date for money. I feel like you should date someone who cares for you the way you pour into them. Meaning, like, it's like this. If I could give you $1,000, but you can't give me receipt, I don't think we're on the same page. If you have a passport, but I... Like, I have a passport, you don't have a passport, we're not on the same page. If I have a 401k and I want to have a life insurance and make sure I have money to the side and save up to 3000 you don't even believe that you can save 3000 we're not on the same page. I like working a 9 to 5, self-employed, and getting to my money, you want to be too much into lust. And then, you know, it's even worse when you got a car and you're trying to teach someone how to make money and they don't even have a car and they just focus on lust. You see how the priorities is messed up? You want someone who's as ambitious and generous and go-getter mindset as you because you want to have that fun traveling. You don't want to be with someone where they like an anchor that you're dragging along. Somebody who don't want to have, you're not, you're not their mom to make the agenda or teach this woman how to be a hustler or this man. That's what I got for you guys. Learn to say no. 
Okay.